Hi, this is Gusto. I have a good one tonight. Today I got something in the mail a little bit earlier than expected, so I'm going to go ahead and break into this. Uh, um, what I'm going to do tonight is this guy. This is a life raft tablet ration. It's a bailout ration. And on the can, you can see the date of production, December 1950 to January 1951. So, uh, you can see on there the, oh, let's see, I think there was a, yeah, there's a contract number and a, um, uh, I don't know how to decipher that, but um, there's pretty clearly on the can the date of production at the latest, January 1951. Now, Steve 1989 reviewed one of these, uh, uh, put it up this morning, and I'd been waiting on this one for, for a little bit, thought it was going to be later, but I got it today, so I'm going to review it today. And I'm probably going to eat it too. Now, if we look at this can, um, the one that Steve reviewed today was in a lot better looking shape. The, the the state of the can was a lot more consistent. There wasn't a whole lot of rust on there. Uh, you can see a lot of rust on the key there, and hopefully that's not going to be too representative of what's inside, but I'm not, I'm not making any promises. Um, the can does seem to be sealed. There's no, nothing leaking out of it or anything like that. There's no obvious breaks in the can or any you know horrible rust spots. It's certainly not rusted through anywhere. This little dent uh, doesn't penetrate. So um, maybe it's going to be okay at in in parts, but uh, you know, we'll see what we find. Hopefully, I don't end up like our friend here, but uh, uh, we'll see. All right, so the life raft tablet ration um, contains a lot of carbohydrate carbohydrate rich um, uh, items. Uh, this one lists a sucrose citric acid tablet, sucrose lipid citric acid tablet. Um, be interesting to see how the lipid tablets fared after uh, 66 years. Um, we have sucrose malted milk tablets. Again, the milk is going to be a little bit iffy. Multivitamin tablets. I've been told that the vitamin B6 in here goes pretty darn bad, so I might taste it, but uh, I kind of anticipate that wouldn't be a nasty. Chewing gum tablets also in there. So those, I think, are chiclets. I think there's two of them in there uh, from what I've seen before. Uh, at any rate, uh, like I said, this can's a little iffy. Um, uh, got some rust around the bottom rim. Hopefully that didn't penetrate into the can, but I don't see any obvious holes. Anyway, key's pretty rusted, but let's uh, let's get this thing open. It is a spam can style, so we'll lift our tab. Let's see if there's a hiss. None whatsoever. That's a little scary. Let's give it a smell. It smells sweet. It certainly doesn't smell doesn't smell like sour or nasty or anything like that. I mean it's it's just kind of a sweet candy smell. It smells I smell the gum. I smell the gum and there you see the chiclets. Uh, first glance it's somewhat encouraging. I mean Better than I expected. I expected to kind of see some, I don't know, with the state of the can, I was kind of worried about, I was worried about it, you know, breaking down and just being funky from the beginning. All right, so there's a bag with a string to close it all up after, uh, since the life raft, you got to keep the things dry, so um, bag with the tie there. Now, it feels a little greasy, so I'm thinking maybe the lipid tablets or the uh, milk-based tablets may have been a little, may not be that great. And you can see my fingers are kind of kind of shiny there. It's all right. We're going to try it anyway. So it says this bag is for unused portions, like I said, keeps everything dry. Now, I'm going to take it as a good sign that this paper is not oily. It's not, um, it's not, uh, it's not broken down. There's nothing that's leaked on it. There's no, there's no, there's no water damage. There's, it, this is a clean, crisp piece of paper. So I'm gonna take that as a good sign. All right. So here is the chiclets. They look to be in very good shape. 
here's the vitamin tablets. I'll taste those and see what, but they're, they're, they'll probably be, probably be not very good. That's sharp. Steve told me to watch my fingers on the edges. Thanks for the advice, Steve. So we have, oh, these are, these are oily. You see that? They smell like candy. I mean, they don't, they, they, they don't smell sour or really that bad. So I'm going to stay optimistic. But with them being oily, I think I'm going to put it all in my tray. All right, so let's start with the, let's see, as the Life Raft Ration. This says sucrose citric acid tablets. This is packaged by the Charms Company, Bloomfield, New Jersey. This is sucrose lipid citric acid tablets. See if it say lipid on this side. Yeah, this does say lipid. So that might be the greasy stuff I'm feeling. Again, smells sweet. Does not. Oh man. There they are. Now we have this one is the sucrose. Citric acid tablets and malted milk tablets. Same company. Now Steve said that uh, on his video that this, the one he tried was the, uh, that was it 56 or 54? I can't remember. He said it was the oldest one that he had seen reviewed and eaten on camera. So this is 50 to 51. Not a contest. That guy's done so much more than me. I respect him extremely highly. He's a good, good guy. So, um, not, not, not playing one-upmanship, but this is just the one that I found. But I'm gonna eat it on camera too. I'm guessing these are the malted milk. These are the sucrose citric acid, and these are the lipid. Those are oily. All right, now Alex, the guy that got me this tray. Um, asked me to save one of these for him, so um, that actually he asked me for the the jelly candies, but I'm gonna save you one of these too and let you try one of these, Alex. So um, I don't know which one's traditionally the best. This one kind of looks broken down, so I'm not gonna give you that one. Probably set that one aside, but oh, maybe one of these green ones. Let's open it up. This is the sucrose citric acid tablet. Yeah, it's printed with charms on there. That's amazing. After you know, you know, 66 years, it's actually held up. It hasn't. You know, some candies will get squishy as they get exposed to any kind of moisture. As the sugars break down and dissolve, they kind of get squishy. But this is hard as a rock. It smells. It smells all right. All right, I'm panned out, so I'm gonna get into this frame. Usually, I'm not gonna show myself on camera, but I have to prove that I'm eating this thing. That tastes good. It tastes just like a fresh piece of candy. Not sour or anything like that. Yeah, that's uh, surprisingly uh, seems to have held up uh, over the years. Amazing. Now the lipid, that scares me, because that just means there's fats in there, and fats and oils go rancid as they oxidize over the years. Ooh, that is really frightening. It's all that oil that has seeped out is what I'm feeling. My fingers are coated in it. All right, so that's it sucrose citric acid lipid tablets but there it is 66 years old Ugh. 
It's got a sweet uh, flavor to it. That oh, it is really pretty sour. <clears throat> Turns chalky. It's overall pretty. It's kind of sweet. It kind of tastes like a toffee or something like that. Kind of breaks down like that, but. Boy, that's sour. I don't think I want to eat any more than that. Any more of that, just for safety's sake. All right. And um, while I'm in this in this angle, I'll just go ahead and get the the malted milk milk tablet. Just for proof, I'll do this on camera. Oh. Trying to decide if I really want to eat this thing. But Steve did it. I'm going to do it too. Hmm. It tastes like the center of a Whopper. That is extremely surprising. It does not taste sour or nasty. It doesn't even have a bad aftertaste. It tastes like the center of a Whopper. That is freaking incredible for a ration that was packaged in 1950. That is absolutely incredible. Considering the state of the can, I was really worried about this thing, but holy smokes. It, it held up. 1950. It's pretty darn old. All right, amazing. 1950, life raft bailout ration. Alex, I'll save one of these candies for you. Here's the vitamin. Let's see how nasty this is. I, I hear everybody say these are gross. Seems like it's coated. Take that coating off as kind of a candy shell. Oh yeah, that's sour. Hmm. Anyway, these are incredibly in good condition. I'm gonna take one of these, to Alex. It's it's just pretty, it's just mind blowing that this has held up this well for 66 years. Just incredible piece of history here. I mean, I'm just, I'm honestly speechless. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing experience. So, um, like the instructions say to do, I'm going to put my unused portions in this bag, except for those lipid tablets. Those are nasty. Put the malted milk in there. Candies. In there. Let's finish this with a chiclet from 1950. Pretty old gum. Do it on camera for proof. Pretty hard and dry. But It chews. Save that for later. Thank you everybody for watching. Thank you Steve for all your help. Hope you all enjoy this. More coming soon. So this has been Life Raft Bailout Ration. Hope you all liked it. Take care. Bye bye. Just in case. Got some memory toilet paper on standby. Let's hope I don't need it.